Hey friends, our tip of the day this time happens to be about baseball and it's that perfect time of year to have like a baseball activity. So try this with your kids. I first just gathered up some of these bottle cap lids. Now I think that it might be easier if you can find a deeper one, kind of like on a pop bottle or something. But since we're using these water bottle lids, we can actually see through it. So I'm going to go ahead and draw on here some of the baseball stitching because that's kind of fun. Why not? And you can just alternate it back and forth with a red permanent marker. And then we're going to glue it on this little bat. Now we used a little Dremel tool or if you've got somebody who can help you do that to cut these out to look like bats, that's awesome. If not, just use a jumbo craft stick and it'll be just fine. And so we're going to glue that on the end of the bat so that it's ready to go. It'll take just a little bit to set up, but not a problem. So we'll stick that on. And then we were testing this out and it's like this might be a little bit short to catch, which would be good if you had some older kids who are smarty pants and they think they can do everything, then you might want a shorter uh, string. But in case you have um, some kids who are struggling with that, get a longer or a taller lid and a little bit longer string. So you can see how I did that, pretty easy. Just cut the string off. <laughs> These scissors are kind of pitiful. Uh, I must have used them a long time. All right, I'm gonna just stick that on right here, but I'm gonna just use some electrical tape because having black tape on there is pretty fun and electrical tape is easy to use. You can either pull it and just break it with your hands like this or if you want to cut it off you can do that too. Pretty easy to do and you can get electrical tape in other colors too. If you want to use red you can do that. So I'm going to just lay the string on there and wrap the tape around several times and secure the string. My lid popped off, so I'm gonna stick it back on. All right, then finally, I've got these cute little beads that look like baseballs. And so it's pretty easy to do. You just put the baseball bead on there and tie a knot. And sometimes you might need to tie a double one just so that it is plenty thick so the bead doesn't go flying off and you lose it. It's a bad day when you lose your bead. So, all right, let's see if that'll work. I think that would be all right. All right, the other thing that I might suggest is that you could have them write a Bible verse on the back of the bat. There's room to do it. If you use um, a sharp one like, um, uh, like this, this is considered a fine tip but you'll need an extra fine tip to write this. So when I am afraid, I will trust in you, Psalm 56, three, and then let the kids practice. See who can get the most points catching the baseball. Obviously it's not me. <laughs> so try this idea with your kids during this season. It'll be a lot of fun. Things that boys like is always gonna be a win. Girls seem to like everything. And so this will be a fun thing to try. Be sure to sign up at Mr. Mark's Classroom and get our tip of the week and you'll be notified each and every time.